arrested this afternoon in the trial of one of the defendants in the Columbiana Mall mass shooting from Easter weekend of 2022. Two and a half years later, after this terrifying scene. 24 year old Dwayne Price is one of three charged in the mass shooting. More than a dozen were injured, nine with gunshot wounds. Nick Neville is live on this story for us tonight. Nick, I understand several of the victims testified today. What did they share with the jury from the stand? Judy Hanna, they said it's really been two and a half years of trauma. In fact, one shooting victim testified that she never even went back to high school after all of this, fearful of crowds and that something like this could happen again. Victims of the Columbia Mall mass shooting over Easter weekend 2022 took the stand Tuesday at the trial of Joanne Price, one of the men who engaged in the shootout. The effects of being there amid the chaos and being shot will likely stay with the victims the rest of their lives, they say. I still have digestive, um, lingering digestive um, problems. One victim was just 16 at the time. She described the moments after being shot in the back when she was finally able to get in touch with her dad. I called him and I said that I got shot and I asked him if I was going to die. And I told him to get there as fast as he could and then fly. I'm dead, I'm not sure how. A crime scene reconstruction expert also testified Tuesday. The state establishing the price fired first, arguing that he was the aggressor here. Did you actually see him? step towards Robinson. Yeah, you'll actually, so he starts here and he actually makes a kind of a diagonal movement towards this edge of the, the, the back opposite edge where he's at. While he does that, what are we seeing in his hand? Uh, he has his firearm drawn out. And who is it pointing at? Mr. Robinson. Price has argued self-defense, saying that he feared for his life when he saw the other two co-defendants at the mall. His attorney, Todd Rutherford, passionately trying to make this point in the courtroom with a demonstration. So it's not like he, he's just running down the hall to get away. He is still shooting back in that, in that direction. Correct. Thank you. He did not completely turn his back on the two people that he thought were trying to shoot him and kill him. Isn't that right? Correct. Again, the state rested its case this afternoon. The defense did not put up any witnesses. We'll hear closing arguments on Thursday morning. Reporting in Lexington, Nick Neville, WIS News 10. Nick, thank you so much. Amari Smith and Marquise Robinson are also charged in the mass shooting. All three men face attempted murder charges. Smith and Robinson expected to be tried after Price's trial ends.